Salve, this is Attack on Titan Colossal Edition 3, and you can see that's Brock Lesnar on the cover, the Armor Titan, and that's who it was based on. You can see number three right there. So let me just do the back real quick. Traitors revealed and traumas relived. After barely beating back a Titan incursion at War Rose, the Survey Corps is left, facing even more mysterious questions. Yet there is no time to answer them, as humanity's mortal enemies, the Colossal Titan and the Armor Titan, suddenly and dramatically appear. Shocked at the identities of these genocidal agents, the corpse can't report, but respond quickly enough. What seemed like one more victory on a march back to War Maria has now become a mad scramble to win back hope for humanity at any cost. So anyways, I basically... I base got all these for around 33, 30 bucks. I try to wait till they're on sale. And uh, yeah, this is based on uh, Brock Lesnar, the Armor Titan. You can see it's actually pretty cool, pretty cool icon. I don't want to give any spoilers. And I have the anime and I have the manga. This is the manga I got into from the anime. So and this is the first manga that I really got a physical copy of. Uh, people on YouTube have these like action like manga comics. I've seen some for One Punch Man and other stuff, but they go after them for copyright claims. But if it wasn't for that, I would have never gotten into Attack on Titan. Reading ahead the chapters of Attack on Titan really made a difference. So I would have never bought this if I didn't read it. So you know what? If you read stuff online and you think it's worth getting, you're going to get a physical copy. Some stuff's really hard to get a physical copy. Like if I get a deluxe edition of Black Clover, I'd get it. But I'm not going to get 30 volumes, you know? Ghost Reaper Girl, I have one volume of. It's going to be four or five volumes. How many? You know what I mean? I would like to get Goblin Slayer. I wish Goblin Slayer had deluxe editions. But that's something I might get the volumes of. But anyways, you know, try to get the Colossal Editions. There's seven of them, I think. I have about six. I'm going to get the seventh eventually. Try to wait it out. Try to get them on sale for like 30 bucks. Sometimes a coupon. Sometimes Barnes & Nobles has a thing. So I bought a few at Barnes & Nobles. I got a few on Amazon. So these things might come damaged because they're soft covered. So you got to be a little more careful. I don't know where to really get plastic for them. I, a few of them have plastic. So anyways, like I said, Attack on Titan. I think it starts out better than when you get to about season three. I wasn't too happy about that, at least part one, part two is better. And they omit a lot of the stuff in the uh, in the manga. So I think this is the one where they skip a lot of chapters that's not in the anime for um, Colossal Edition 3. But anyways, if you get a chance, check it out, Attack on Titan. Thanks, Colossal Editions. Thanks, and take care.